check out these new pictures of Cameron Diaz. Look at those toned arms. Well, that set the internet abuzz with a new debate. Can a woman be too toned? Do bulging muscles enhance or detract from feminine beauty? ABC's Lindsay Davis tackles these questions today with her muscular mind. These are the bulging biceps, washboard stomachs, lean, mean, can't pinch an inch bodies of women who some critics say need to tone it down. That again is... Hello, hi. Gravity. How are you? Cameron Diaz has recently come under fire for her sculpted muscles, broad shoulders, and V-shaped hardened physique. But this is what she's worked so hard for, with grueling, punishing workouts similar to those of her buff boyfriend, A-Rod, who, by the way, no one's ever criticized for being two-toned. In today's society, men are supposed to be big and strong. But women, there may be a double standard. You want arms like this, baby? Look at that. Kelly Ripa has been ripped for being too ripped. Madonna had people up in arms for being too vain, so to speak. But perhaps Serena Williams depicts the pop culture paradox best. She's been described as either too muscular to be feminine or too fat for tennis. We have to start as a culture accepting women in our new roles and that's as strong, confident, uh, beautiful, muscular, curvy women. Summer White is a fitness model who says bring on the muscle. I did see pictures of Cameron Diaz in her beautiful yellow bathing suit and I thought she looked phenomenal. There's a big difference between essential fats for men and for women. Essentially we're talking about the minimum amount of fat necessary for basic physical health. The minimum for women is 10 to 13 percent while for men it's 2 to 5 percent. Still for some it's now trendy to be a real-life G.I. Jane. For Good Morning America, Lindsay Davis, ABC News, New York.